Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to share with you all the goodies that I received from my girls. Um, a few girls gave me gifts. Uh, thank you gifts for um, the retreat and I wanted to just share them with you. Uh, first up, this is from Morgan Snow. Look at all the fun goodies in here. And if you know who Morgan Snow is, she's pretty famous. <laughs> she made this cute basket and fun little thing about Morgan is when I first entered the crafting community I got something like this from Morgan as a swap and oh my gosh I just fell in love with all the goodies she had put in there and ever since then I've been making like little baskets and stuff for like hostesses myself and so when I saw this I was like oh my gosh this is why I make these things for hostesses too um, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started and just share this with you uh, so first up, we got some cute washi tape. Love it. This You can always use this. Then we have, um, it looks like from Bath & Body Works, uh, white pumpkin soap. Yay. And this, look at this cute ribbon. I did not get this ribbon from Michael's this year, and I wanted it so bad. So I'm glad I got some of it. Looks like there's a body cream. Yay. Let me smell it. Oh my God, this smells so good white pumpkin and chai and then also all the candle oh, love it and put it in the bathroom let's see what other goodies she gave me oh how cute the little um sanitizer holder oh my gosh look at the kitty fun fact about me i don't like cats but i love kitty things so this is just adorable so cute look at the little necklace next up cute little pail look at how cute her little details a pail with oh my gosh look at this so cute with the theme right a little witch finger and the word fright Ooh, it was put on a nice thick sticker cute and then ooh, some uh my mind's going blank um sparkles some mix sequence mix there it is I knew it was going to come to me some cool sequence mix and look at the green like she totally color coordinated everything Ooh, some tool yes I can always use that look at how cute this cool little um these are I think it's a mirror I think let me see or no maybe it's a pin is that what it is I can't remember I think I've seen one of these in the past let me see if I can open it how cute oh, it is a pen how cute is that so adorable right and some cool trim and some cute little um, bows with the witch attached I'm gonna totally reuse that I love how she used like a foam so cute absolutely love it and this cool basket with some more tool so thank you Morgan love everything definitely gonna use all these Bath and Body Works um, items and of course the crafty things I appreciate you girl Morgan's been coming to my crops for the last uh, two years I've done three and she's come to every single one of them and I just have to tell you she's such a joy and I absolutely have to have her at each one so thank you Morgan so much I'm gonna put this to the side next up let's see Ooh, my finger next up this is from Patty Patty is, oh, there it is. Okay, I'm gonna share that in a minute. Patty is um, on Instagram as small letter S, and she gave me, you've been booed. If you can see that, I'm trying to show you on the camera. This cute bucket, look at the bucket. Isn't that adorable? All the cute, let me show you like that. All the cuteness in this bucket. I do not wanna give this bucket up. I need to keep this bucket. I don't know where she got it, but I absolutely love it. Um, so let's dig in. San Diego Halloween meetup. Ooh, it's a postcard. Look at how cute this postcard is. Absolutely love it. This is perfect for junk journaling added in there. How cute is that? And then let's see what else. You are beautiful. Oh, this goes like perfectly with the theme. Thank you, Patty. Let's see. I love peeps. Look at how good these are. These are all mine. And a cute little pumpkin stick. Oh my gosh, who doesn't love these? I do. And oh my gosh, such a cute. Oh, I love how she put the little neon on there. Let's see what's in here. 
Oh, a spider. How cute. I love these. You can use these in your junk journals. I love all the ephemera that people make. Lollipop. Oh, I got another finger. How cute. And the pumpkin necklace and another spider. I love how she decorated this. So, so cute. Oh, cute. A little pumpkin. I love all the little things inside. It's just like what, opening up a surprise box. Thank you so much, Patty. I love it. It's all going in my craft room, each and every part of it. I'm going to stick this stuff back in here. I just love like the way people like stuff things like buckets and bags. It gives us such good ideas for when we need to do something like that. And then we bless the next person. So thank you, Patty, so much. Next up, this is from Judy. Cute little orange festive bag. This was Judy's. I think she's been at Crops and Retreats before, but we were really excited to have her spend the night with us and, and just really, you know, take in the whole event. Ooh, look at this. I wonder what this is. Look at the box, guys. So cute, right? Let's see. Oh my goodness. Look at these. Oh, these are so adorable. I absolutely love these. Do not have anything like these. Can you guys see? Hopefully you guys can see. Oh my God, so, so cute. Thank you, Judy. I love these. I'm gonna wear them on Saturday. We have the grad kids coming on Saturday. And a pair of socks. And it says, if you have it, haunt it. How cute. Absolutely love this. Thank you so much, Judy. I love them and I'm gonna wear them with pride. Next up, I'm gonna share with you this is from Gabby, who is mommy and her four little ladies. Such a cute bag, and I love this tool. Absolutely love this tool, so pretty. Oh, I've gotta save this tool. Look at this cute little bag. I'm gonna go ahead and open up the tool. She had it, she had it tied so perfectly too, a nice big bow. Okay, let me open it up, because I like to save this and reuse it. I've, I've taken so many pictures of the event. I don't think they're all going to fit in my witch books. I'm going to have to make another album just for the event. Oh, how cute. First up, this cute straw. And look at the cute little spider straw topper. Love it. Next up, ooh, cute eye bag with a bunch of Mexican candy. Yes, girl. You know, I don't know about you guys, but I have a whole like um, bowl in my craft room of candy because when you're crafting, you need energy, girls. <gasps> Ooh, how cute is this? I haven't seen this. Look at how this is packaged. So cute. Oh, it came from Michael's. <gasps> Absolutely love it. Look at all the ghosties. I love this mix. So cute. <gasps> oh, she made me something. Let's see. These handmade gifts are the best. Oh my gosh, look at this box. I've always wanted to make something like this. Ooh, this is like sparkly. I've always wanted to make something like this and I haven't put the time into it, but I love to see when other people do it. Ooh, this paper's pretty. Can you guys tell it kind of has like a shimmer? Made with love by mommy and her four little ladies. Oh my gosh, how do I open this? Okay. Oh, this is cute. I thought we pulled it easier. <gasps> Let's look at the goodies, guys. Oh my gosh. <gasps> I gotta open these, okay? We gotta see like the full effect of these. <gasps> oh, how cute. Okay, first up. Oh, I love how she put the seed beads in there. <gasps> that is such a satisfying shaker. So cute. And look at the ghost is like a little ombre. <gasps> so cute, girl. She made me two witches. Oh, aren't they darling? I love them. Absolutely love them and so cute. This dye girl, where is this dye from? It's so cute. And it looks like they are those kind of witches that their legs move, but I need to find out how to do that. So you put something in the back and then the legs kind of move like this. So, so cute. How cute is that? So there's her legs and her legs. How adorable. Okay, Gabby, I'm gonna message you and ask you, what am I supposed to put back here so I can make the legs move? Because I don't even know. Is there like, like a, I don't know. Is it like a fastener of some kind? These are adorable. I'm gonna put them back in here just because I don't want them to get messed up. How cute. I love these little homemade 
ephemera. So cute. Okay. And it looks like, ooh, this is cute. Let me open this. We gotta get the full effect. Shakers are such a big deal. Oh, how cute. I love the colors in here. She put a little bit of neon in there. Look at the little pumpkins. Oh, this is adorable. And it's almost like it has a lid. How cute. And then look at these details right here. Oh, I love the little seed bead. Oh my gosh. She sewed these on, you guys. <gasps> By hand. That is so freaking cool. <gasps> I love that, Gabby. So cute. So she sewed them on and then put the backing on. Oh man, girl. These are these are just adorable. Thank you so much. These are going to go. I'm telling you guys, I'm going to have to make another book just for everything else. Because I'm not going to be able to fit it all in the witch book but and then she put it in this box oh adorable gabby thank you so much i absolutely love it let me make sure i can put this little there it goes and then look at this she cut and then she stitched she stitched on their girls and then oh my god the little rosette oh so adorable thank you so much i'm gonna put this one to the side Hope you guys are enjoying. There's, these girls are just amazing. All their creativity and their generosity. It's just, I, I think about it all year long, how sweet they are. Um, this, I believe, is from Andrea, Crafty Mom of Two. Look at how adorable that is. She did the neon colors and the spider web. Look at all that layering just in this tag and then the stitching. And this is a cauldron. So it's a cauldron memory dex with all the stitching on it. I mean, she is just fabulous at layering. So freaking creative. I love it. And the box, I mean the bag, the black and white. I don't know, I'm so into black and white right now. Look at, you can tell my table. This is my kitchen table. Um, so I'm totally into black and white right now. So cute. Let's see, I'm gonna pull from the back first. Ooh, cute. She always has the cutest bags. So let's see. Love these little hollow bags. Okay, get it open. All the goodies. Oh my gosh. I love this. <gasps> Look at how cute. Bats. Bats are adorable. Pumpkins. Oh, look at the little groovy. The groovy ghost. She gave me a pair of earrings last year, and I've worn them a couple times already. Of these like little groovy ghosts. So cute. <gasps> Spider webs. And these are like the foam. So they're nice and thick to layer on. How cute girls and a lot of um, solid colored ones. Oh my gosh, so cute. Oh, spider webs. I don't know, I'm loving the foam because it's nice and thick and it just adds so much to your project. Thank you so much. This is so cute. Let me stick these in here. If I can get through. Yes. There's that. There's some, also some other stuff in here too. I'm gonna pull from the back. Oh my God, how cute. Eat, drink, and be scary. This is adorable. I love when people use dyes in different ways. Like here she added the Halloween twist to the mixer. I would have never thought of that. It's so adorable. Oh, with a cute little note. Oh, how cute. Thank you so much. This is that paper she used that um, it's saying like Spanish things, um, like the zombie, uno de zombie, juegos malidos. <laughs> um, so, so cute. Thank you so much. I love the card. That's also gonna go in my book. And then there's something else in here. I'm gonna share it. <gasps> Look at how cute the bow and the candy corn and the tool. I love how she wrapped that a few times. And then let's see, let's see what's in here. <gasps> so excited. Oh my gosh, this girl is mad talented. Look at this. It's a little mini shadow box, guys. A cauldron, magic potion. Oh my God, it's just like a whole scenery. So cute. Oh my gosh. Look at this. It even has a little eyelet right here. How cute is that? <gasps> Oops. And then a little potion bottle. Oh my gosh, I love how she did this. 
look at this cute little, oops, out of frame, sorry. Little pumpkin head. She glued it to the top and look at this mix. Sometimes these mixes are so pretty. I don't even want to use them. I just want to look at them. So cute. And then, oh my gosh, look at this spider. She made it into a shaker. Oh, how cute. Adorable. A little ghosty. Oh, I don't have this die. This is so cute. What a little happy, happy mail tail. How cute. Oh, and a bunch of words. Wicked. Oh, I love this. I love the light pink against the black like that. Wicked. Halloween. Ooh. Scream. 31st. Oh, these, these are perfect for our books. Creepy. Oh my gosh. And look at all the little banners she made. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love how she did that. She popped them up so they're nice and thick. How cute is that? With all the little um, cute shred inside, guys. These are adorable. I have to pull them all out. Be patient with me. Look at how cute. The pumpkins. <gasps> adorable. Just adorable, girl. Oh, how cute is that? And then I have to show. Look at the cute paper that's inside. Oh, isn't it so cute? Thank you so much, Andrea. I love all the goodies. You're always, your creativity is just always top notch. And I'm just so honored to have some of your, some of your things that you made. And so happy that you and Gabby were there with us. We had such a wonderful time with you and you know, we've got to do it more often. You know, this is our happy place where we get to just socialize and be creative and have fun and it's just the best. I don't know. I don't want to squish these, so I'm going to put these back. And I'm going to put this to the side because I do not want to mess up my shaker. So I'm going to stick it right here so it's nice and safe. Um, I'm going to move this one to the side. And oops, forgot to write it. Okay, next up, this is from Daphne. So it's just this cute bucket. It's hard to show all of it here. This cute bucket, the Halloween buckets. Oh, love them. And I'm going to open it up. So she put this cute tag. Love this. Trick or treat. Smell my feet. Daphne's also a new crafter. She's really natural at it. Like a lot of the girls who get into crafting, they just turn into like these master crafters. Oh my gosh, look at how cute. I'm going to pull this out. Look at how adorable. She put the ribbon on here to make it neon, which is brew. Added the little tassel. How cute is that? So, so cute. It opens up. Oh, what a fun way to package it. Let me see. I think there is something in here. Oh, how cute. <gasps> Diamond dots. Ooh, the white iridescent. We can always use those. <gasps> Look at how cute. Some neon sequins with the Halloween. So cute. How cute is this? Look at all of this. <gasps> so Halloweenish, right? And some cuteness, some orange. You can always use orange. And I think there's one more. Oh, some more orange. So nice to have the two different types. Thank you so much, Daphne. This is so cute. Girl, you really packed this in here. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. <laughs> I'm going to put it to the side because I'm going to end up putting it away in my craft stuff. So I'm going to put it to the side. But absolutely love how she um, decorated that, that jar. Let's see what else is in here. This is like a bucket of awesomeness. Let me open this next one. Look at how cute. She put the ribbon. I love the way the ribbon looks against the tissue paper. So, so cute. Let me see. I'm going to have to pull it off this way. Sorry about the noise, guys. Let's see. Oh, how cute. It's like an iridescent ghosty. Oh, how cute is this? Look at how cute they are. Which ghosties? So cute. Love it. Thank you, Daphne. This is so cute. 
Let me see. There's a couple other things in here. Oh, look at how cute. I love how she put like all the spider web stuff all over everything. And she made this little, I think she did this with her Cricut. So, so cute. Oh my gosh. And she did multiples to make it like thick. Daphne's also new at using her Cricut and she just becomes so natural at it. It's so fun seeing all the things she makes. Let's see, next up, let's see what else. Boo to you, there's a little something in here. Ooh, how cute is this? Oh my gosh, she had to eat it. So cute. A little ghosty clip, just what I needed. I don't have anything for my hair that's Halloween, but you know me, right now I'm trying to wear all my Halloween stuff. Super cute. And then there's one more thing. Let's see. Ooh, a cute little makeup bag. How adorable. Look at this. Love it. Super cute. This is the patty. Super cute. Very boho. And then she gave me a cute card. I'm not going to open it. Let's see. Might be something personal. Let's see. But look at how cute. We call each other hermosa. We've always called each other hermosa. But look at this cute bat. So cute. Trick or treat. Let me see. I don't want to tear it. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'll show you because it looks like she, she did some fun stuff to it. Happy Halloween with the little tags. <gasps> Look at it, it's a little witch. Oh my God, how cute is that? So, so cute. There's probably something personal, so I won't share it on the inside, but super cute, Daphne. Thank you so much, girl. I love all your creativity and the gifts are just amazing and can't wait till next year, girl. We gotta think up our next, our next theme and what the balloons are gonna be like. Daphne always does the balloons for me and they're always such a big hit. So we've got, we've got to start planning what next year is going to be all about. That's for sure. Let me move this to the side. And next up, this is the cutest. Oh, I'm going to share that in a minute. This is the cutest bag from Monica. Look at how cute. It's very pastel weed with a little Frankenstein here. She gave me this goodie with all, I love the, look at the way the tool and the eyelet looks. It's just so festive. Let me see. Oh, how cute is this? A candy, oh, perfect. Like a candy corn banner, guys. Oh my gosh, so cute, perfect. I'm gonna use this actually at uh, probably Thanksgiving time. Oh, I love it. Thank you so much, Monica, so thoughtful. Wait, is there something else? Oh, I think there's something else in here. I love this. I'm old school. I like the, the, the what is this? The tissue paper that has like the glitter. Oh, I just, I love it. Ooh, ooh, she made me a pen. Look at how cute is that? <gasps> this bright turquoise and the bright turquoise. Oh my God, so, so cute. She does make pens. She doesn't sell them, but she usually gives them for like, uh, goodies or just to her friends and oh my god I freaking love this one thank you so much I know she made it <gasps> oh my gosh <laughs> look at this night flyer embrace the darkness and find your light keep flying oh I love this this is adorable where did you find this this is adorable this is going in the craft room of course some cute socks we always need socks and I think there's something else in here. Okay. Oh, how cute. How adorable. I think these were at Michael's, I think. Oh my God, how cute. This has also got to go in the craft room. Look at how adorable. Thank you, Monica. Everything's so beautiful. I love it as always. I'm gonna stick it in here. Thank you so, so much. Next up, I wanna share this with you guys. I could not find it, so Gabby, please forgive me. These um, were the goodies made by Gabby and she gave them to everyone. So in the last video, I showed all the goodies that everybody gave and I know I was enthralled by it and I, I had it in my hand and I must've put it in this one of these bags because I just found it um, because I didn't wanna lose it. But I just wanted to share with you how cute. These were the goodies she gave to everybody. And I love the simplicity and just the cuteness of it. 
she did the tool and it's on a sucker and then she just put these little witch hats adorable thank you so much gabby i i couldn't find it for the last video but i wanted to make sure i shared it with everyone i just love this idea i'm totally going to do this idea sometime in the future super cute next up let's see oh this is from monica another gift from monica so i think i got two gifts from monica i love the bag i'm going to use this in a junk journal just saying and then let's see oh my gosh how cute you have to see these let me see oh oh it's a top and a bottom okay so she got me jammies and they're cute little Halloween gnomes. So the shorts, look at how cute. And then the top. Oh, I love it. Thank you, Monica. This will help when I have those hot flashes and I need something cool to wear. Look at how cute is that? Aw, thank you, girl. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Your friends always know you best, right? Next up, this is from Martha. And I didn't even know that I guess Target had these little ghosty bags, ghosty jelly bags. Girl, I try to stay away from Target this season. Um, but she got me one and it's so cute. And she, look how she put the straw. She kind of like put the straw through the bag, adorable. And then look at, she made she made me a um, the, the cutest thing. She made me like a little friendship tassel of my um, YouTube name, my IG name, Craft Magic Repeat. Bruja's Bash, the name of the event, so thoughtful, and she taped it on so I can use it. So this is going to go on my junk journal as well. She made these fabulous tassels for us. Absolutely love them. Aren't they so cool? She said she YouTubed it, but I'm mean, she's so creative. So I'm going to go ahead and get started and share what's inside. So first up, a little G. So cute, right? To put those little tiny things you need to keep track of um let's see here there's also this embossing folder with the waves oh i can't wait to use this so cute so an embossing folder um she also got me a bunch of stuff cutting mat it's a really cool cutting mat four by five this is really cool for like just little things and it has like the wave to it so that's awesome and then oh my gosh so look at how creative these are guys she made these bows um these bows are made out of the remnants from this tassel all the little tiny pieces that fell she saved them and made these bows and i just have to share with you there's four in here look at how gorgeous these are guys i would have never thought look at you can make them into a hair bow put them on a book anything i just think they're she's so incredibly talented look at that aren't they amazing so cute right and then she gave me some mini ones too so there's a few mini ones with all the colors from the tassels and i just love the colors so so cute there's four in here and then let's see oh she got me this because i did get some of the page taylor evans stuff um not a lot and i didn't get these so these are the page inserts and page protectors, 24 page protectors for the Paige Taylor Evans Tricks and Treats book. So got some of those. She also added, look at this mug. So cute, right? It's like ghosty meets Beetlejuice vibes. So adorable. And then inside, um, a gel plate conditioner. So I started doing gel printing. Um, I don't really share it a lot on my channel because I'm still playing with it, but it's super fun. And so this is something that'll help keep my gel plate um, in good condition. So she's always so thoughtful and like looks at what I'm into and kind of gets me things to, um, you know, support that. So she's just a really thoughtful friend. Um, and then also she loves, she knows how I like to alter books. So she found these and oh my God, they're so cute. Look at this one. Frankie's dance party little ghosty book this one is oh the kitty little book and then this one is a witch book so cute right she found me all of them and so you know I've got to alter these um, and then on the back side of this jelly she did the same thing I want to show you the other part of it so she did the same thing and put the other straw through here so creative right 
absolutely love absolutely love everything martha thank you so much you're always so thoughtful and so creative and i just i just feel blessed to have have you as a friend i feel blessed to have everyone as a friend to be honest with you it's just you know so comforting when you have you know these friends that you may not get to see all the time but when you do you just pick up where you left off and you have such a wonderful time together and i'm grateful for that um so i'm going to set these aside and then i have one more to share with you and then we're done with this video this was from my friend christine she i love the bag absolutely love this bag it's the bag from michael's the trick or treat i think it was i'm not sure if it was this past season and she put i'm going to share with you i just had to show the bag because it was so cute um this girls look at this i don't know if it we might have killed the battery because i had it on for a while where's the i don't know where the i thought there was oh there it is oh it's it's touch oh my gosh look at how cute is this funny story i told christine this i went to michael's and i saw this probably three or four times this season and i kept telling myself no you don't need it you don't need it but inside i wanted it really bad and she got it for me so i'm so thankful and i absolutely love this and my friend Nee kept wanting it too i'm like Nee, it was I, I would give it to you but it was a gift um i didn't want to give it up so thank you so much christine absolutely love this and she also gave me this which is so true i as soon as she gave it i opened this gift um at the retreat i put this up by the coffee maker or by the coffee area and this was by the coffee maker and i'm a nightmare before coffee because this was so cute so absolutely love this combo such a cute idea um so i just want to thank everybody for everything i you know not only um do i love the gifts but more importantly i love you know your friendship and you know the companionship we have as crafters it's super valuable so i just really want to thank everyone not just the people who gave me gifts but everyone for you know honoring me with their presence and and just being there with us to to craft and i look forward to next year's working on a theme and um it is invite only uh, because it's a private crop i don't open it up to the public and that's because it's just a special thing um but i'll definitely share photos and you guys can get to see all all the stuff we made and and all that good stuff so again thank you everyone love you guys and can't wait to see you guys again soon and uh, catch me on the next video where i show you the make and take i designed of the witch book so i'll see you soon bye